Welcome back, fellow Reapers. We are going to go through Darion. This is going to be your second round through. If you don't have White Beam yet, go and take a look at the video that should be popping up on the card at the top right of the screen right about now. We're going to show you the maps, but we're going to go through pretty fast, so just pause and take a look at them if you need to. Those are the paths that we take. If you want to take a longer look at them, you can always move it to 75% because we move through this pretty fast. Or you can also go to the link in the description for the maps. And that's our site where you can take a look at everything longer and we'll continue to update that as well. So we were trying to get this energy tank, but uh, because of the lava you can't and so we'll have to be back for that later. So you just drop down and then uh, hop back up. Go through and talk to Adam. So, I'm Venom Wolf. I'm Rogue Rider. We're Death Tactics and we really like to play video games. Uh, Want to give you guys some more help on the Darion Emmy just because it is difficult. It's a lot of moving back and forth between places. Yeah. But you figure it out eventually. So, uh, not quite sure how to deal with those guys yet, but if you need an energy recharge, it's just above this spot. Just hop up there. How you guys doing today? I like to know. And then you're gonna enter the secure zone. Um, just gonna be careful because this Emmy is very fast. Make sure to use that Phantom Cloak. Make sure he doesn't see you before you use the Phantom Cloak, otherwise it's pretty much pointless. And you're just going to keep climbing to the top and go through the door on the right. Hope you can move faster than him. Blast this away. And then just keep moving to the top, and then once you hit the top, go to the left. I just wanted to, you know, make it a very close call. <laughs> Build that suspense. Yeah. So this area doesn't have power, so you gotta turn it on. So you're just gonna come in here, climb. There's a full recharge station once the power's back on. Which is definitely helpful. No recharging missiles and energy tanks. I always keep trying to go that way. There's a map room, it'll be great when you turn on the power. This zone will be cold when you turn on the power, though, so be careful with that. Yeah, this will be one to come back through later. <sighs> Missed it. <laughs> it's like where you miss grabbing the ledge by one finger. It happens to me all the time. <laughs> so this is a power room, so you'll just hit the switch and it'll turn the power on in that room that we were just in. And we are going to go ahead and show you guys the map. This is the next path uh, to turn on the map room and also grab the bombs or power bombs for all the people that have played this in the past. Some of the predecessor games. So there's that full recharge uh, station again. Just climb back up to the top. I still want to go that way. <laughs> Grab the map room real quick. Which is totally helpful for us to show you how to get there. It is definitely helpful. <laughs> Alright, now that that's done, you're gonna go back up through and go through this missile door. And then you're gonna grab this power up, which is bomb. And then you're going to blow away the floor. Uh, there's also going to be a missile tank that you can get. All right, and then we're going to show you the map. Uh, you're going to head to Burion or Buren? Burinia. Burinia. Um, but these are nice. You just set a bomb off and 
it'll launch you through and it just drops you off at the next section and you just keep going. I'm like a pinball. Yeah. <laughs> it's quite helpful. I just imagine like how she's sitting there in that, like, you know, the shape of the ball and everything. Like, how, how does she fit? <laughs> I keep thinking about how she's probably nauseous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's nice because then you didn't have to go through that secure zone. But it's not the only one. There's a save if you would like it. We always do, just because... You never don't... know what's going to happen. Yeah. Could lose power. The console could crash. You don't know. You could die. We don't want that. This one's definitely a lot more forgiving with death, so... I don't know, man. And then you're going to come into the secure room and just keep going down. You're just going to zigzag. Try not to touch that guy. And then you're going to climb here. Just keep on heading through. Now well, all of a sudden you're in a whole different kind of environment. Yeah, but it's a flying uh, squid. foreshadow. I know. I'm just saying. You really like the environments. Yeah, I do too. All, All right. right, you made it. <laughs> Jinx. Jinx. I'm going to beat you to it. All right, now we're going to go for the flash shift. It's an Aeon ability. It's pretty nice. I actually like it. It's probably my favorite. It's the one I use the most. Quick train ride. Berinia. <laughs> Quicker for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> longer for us. Then you're gonna drop down. These guys are really nice if you uh, use a bomb. I, I didn't realize it when I first hit them, but it's really nice because they'll suck in the bomb faster and it'll go off on them and takes care of them really quick. And then you're just gonna climb. Definitely take care of these guys before you jump up because uh, as you can see, they're a pain. They pick you back off each other? Yeah. They just keep pulling you in the other directions. Distract you with one. Shoot you with the other. All right, then you're gonna... Take care of that guy, too. Yep. And then jump up there. Curve around, jump back up. And then you're gonna go through this door. And then these guys, you can shoot them with a bunch of missiles. Um, or you can miss uh, half the time. I seriously just wait till they're done shooting their laser and then dodge underneath them. Morph ball and zigzag up. Through this door. Talk to Adam again. He's a very chatty guy for a computer. I was thinking so too. I think he's lonely on that show. Very fast talker, though. <laughs> Alright, then you're gonna head to the left. And then jump down. This guy shoots a whole bunch of babies at you. They're really nice to replenish if you need. And then you can go up here to the left if you need to recharge your missiles. If not, just keep going. so annoying. Just grapple and, or not yeah, grapple, but oh. spider magnet over. If you want a missile tank, it's going to be over here on the upper right bit. Climb, climb, climb. Yeah, I messed up. I mean, you can literally just jump here and shoot it, because if you do the bombs, you're just going to drop. Mess that one up. That's oh, okay. But yeah, just one shot and you should be able to take care of both. Yay, missiles. And then just go back and keep going forward. I really like this environment. It's kind of like Bioshock. I really like all the environments. They're very detailed. Yeah, this is my favorite though. Okay, now you're just gonna fall down. 
then jump back up, and then... We could go to the right and try and get that energy tank, however, without the flash. You're, you're not just gonna get through. Yeah, you're just gonna fall down. Don't worry, that's what we're gonna go get. I imagine the uh, speedrunners are gonna find some different way if they're wanting to get that. This is a safe room, so again, use it at your own risk. At your own risk? Or your will, I don't know. I feel like it'd be a risk not to use it. Not really, this game's very forgiving. But hey, if you put the console down and walk away and then you know, somebody else comes up and uh, closes their game. Yeah, I hate it when that happens. I'm really sorry. <laughs> and then you're just going to keep falling. Um, the thing is, is when you go over this ledge, hug the left side as much as you can because it allows you to get a missile plus tank. And if you don't hug the left, you're going to fall. And then so, have fun getting back up to that. Yeah, so there that is. And then you'll just fall down from there. And then you'll make your way over to the other side and start climbing back up. It really sucks in water because you can't jump as high. These guys aren't much of a risk. They're just more annoying. You can go through this tunnel. Head up. Do not go out that door because it's just gonna drop you. It's, there's nothing to do there. And then blow out this hole in the wall. Go up the magnets. And then just jump and go through the door right here. And get ready for a battle. Cinematic battle. <laughs> I'd have to battle the statue. Give me the cube. And there you go, that was the battle. You are now the proud owner of Flash Shift. Best ability ever. Can move like the speed of light. Five feet. <laughs> <laughs> There's the map you're gonna want to go to this the lower Darion uh, train. Got to save again, so we are super careful. I think if you look at it, I spend more time saving than actually doing anything else. <laughs> Climb up, just flash shift over this, and then now you can get that energy tank. Just kind of jump and flash shift. If you just run over, that's what's going to happen. You're just going to fall. So just kind of give it a little hop and then flash shift over. Jump up, flash shift back over. Deal with this guy. Not gonna go through this door. Jump back down. You're gonna have to lower the water to get out of here. So there's a missile tank there, but we can't get it yet until you get the gravity suit. I mean, I think if you're fast enough. You might be able to, but I'm not entirely sure on that one. Okay, well, we were not fast enough. Yeah, no, we were not. Because, like, it's it's instant. So I'm not quite sure on that one. You could get it with the grapple beam, too. Mm. You just got to do a bomb to get through that. And really, all you have to do is blow this out. You don't even actually have to go up there. It's kind of pointless. It just kind of shows you that yeah, it's really lowered. Unless there's something I don't know about. Impossible. <laughs> yeah, sure. Just reclimb back to where you came in. Now you can go through. Don't go up, because that's going to go back to the other train. You just need to drop down here and shoot that away. Now we're going to go for the central unit. 
back to Darion. Yeah. <laughs> this entire one is just essentially in a security zone. Hope you got your running boots on. I'm gonna go through the door. <laughs> I like how you get flash shift and then like most of the stuff you do is just in water and you can't use it. Yeah. Well for now it comes in handy a lot though. Yeah. So that guy's most likely gonna be there so you can just jump here and hide. Move along, sir. Nothing to see here. Hopefully. <laughs> if you want, you can also go into ball, morph ball and hide right there. You're gonna have to uncloak so you can jump up higher. And quickly? Just, yeah, and just climb and then go through and duck through this. Drop down, go through. Jump up here, slide under. You just gotta keep climbing and you're gonna hit, you're going for the top right of this area. Yay, there's that ability. And central unit. Pretty standard fight, just take him out. Dodge. Or dodge, dodge into the ring. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, it's sometimes it's a little hard because I'm only focused on him to make sure that I'm still hitting him with missiles. Plus, I don't care about the, you know, 10, 15, 20 health it takes. But if you like our content, you can also check out our playthrough where you can get our first impressions of the game um, on our other playlist. You'll see it in the top right corner right now. Okay, so now that you have the Omega Beam. You start calling out here, Lassie. Blast your way through this door. It's nice because you just kind of hop up just to get his attention real quick. He's a faster enemy, so he's going to be there. So this long stretch is pretty good because you can get enough damage Space. to him. Yeah. When it breaks, you can just duck right underneath him, which is nice. Don't miss. <laughs> and that takes care of him. Yeah. And congratulations. You are now the proud owner of some faster boots. Or speed booster. For those who want to get technical. Dun dun dun. All right, now we're gonna go grab an energy chink. 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 <laughs> energy tank. Speed booster gets you through all those yellow blocks. So you gotta build it up. Get the quarter tank if you really want it. Which we do. Sometimes. <laughs> kind of build up the speed because those walls are right after this door. Tap off your missiles if you need to. Start heading back up. Those green dots are for a different ability that you'll get. Later. You'll find out later on. And that's what gets you that, uh, Super Missile Tank, or Missile Plus. You don't need to actually do this, I just enjoy doing it. He was showing off. <laughs> You'll have to take care of this first one so you can get some speed. But just run through. Don't forget at the end of the hall to actually duck and trigger your sprite. And then jump up. Fall to the left and get that energy tank. 
And if you want to go talk to Adam, fall to the right. If you don't, just jump up to the right and go through the door. We're going to go talk to Adam real quick. I always really want to make sure I'm at 100% energy for some mm -hmm. reason. Bye, Adam. Bye, Adam. Alright, and this is the path we'll take to get to the yellow teleporter, and that's going to lead you onto your grapple beam. Put you on the, the right path. You could jump from side to side on the walls. If you really want to. I just find it quicker to do this. Plus it looks cool. Yeah. Right into that guy. <laughs> I forgot where I was going there for a second. <laughs> just uh, climb to the top and you're going to be going out the right. But you're going to blast through this wall. If you don't forget where you're going. Jump to clear that. If you remember. <laughs> You're gonna have to take care of that guy. Now you could just drop down. Um, I wanted to expose this to show you guys the grapple wall, I guess. Just drop down, go to the right, go through that door. Another save. Yeah. What do you think we're gonna do? Quick save. <laughs> and then you're gonna go out the door to the right, get a good running sprint. And then just go to the top, you're gonna get a missile tank, and then keep heading to the left to go to the yellow teleporter. And there you go. Yeah, that's all the stuff you need to do for Darien. Darien, Darien. Whatever. Thanks for watching. If you like the content, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and become part of the Reaper community, and the notification bell to get notified of when we're releasing more walkthroughs and other content. And yeah, check out all of our other stuff. Yeah, we do some pretty funny and crazy stuff. We hope you enjoyed. Bye. Bye.